So, therefore, God resists the proud, but what does he do? Give it grace. For the humble. The Baba, what do you want to bring this? Where do wars and fights come from among you? Do they not come from your desires for pleasure that war in your members? You lust and do not have. Your murder and covet cannot obtain. You fight and war, yet you do not have because you do not ask. You ask and do not receive because you ask amiss, that you may spend it on your pleasures. Adulterers and adulteresses do not know what that friendship with the world is enmity with God. Whoever therefore wants to be a friend of the world makes himself an enemy of God. Or do you think that the scripture says in vain, the spirit who dwells in us yearns jealousy? But he gives more grace, therefore he says, God resists the proud, but he gives grace to the humble. Very well. So, so in verse 3, Modile Marakadia. Marele, you ask, but you don't get. Why? Because you're asking for what? Your desires. Your flesh desires. Why there are fights inside us? Very good. So Yana Pagra Palshi. So we are made of what? We are made just like the tabernacle. We are made exactly in the design of the tabernacle. What does the tabernacle has? Has the outer court and then the holy and then the holy of holies. So where is the fight? Where is the fight? The fight is of the outer, which is the body, and the holy, and the holy. So plasha ila bil pagra u bil jana. La burrucha bil jana. It's between the flesh and the soul. There is always a fight. That is why there is a fight in us. The flesh wants what? The flesh wants earthly things. And the soul wants heavenly things. Mom, what's your name? She asked a question about why if we become friends with this world, we become enemies of God. That's her question. And this is a very good question, especially in today's life. Spy book are the best my young so, 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 what? So, the body, the flesh is always fighting all the time. There is a big fight between the flesh and the soul. And the spirit comes in between. The spirit is the referee. So there is always a big fight. Itan khatlasha yura bil pagra u bil jana. In arucha yate go pipal ya yave referee. Okay? Why? Because the, the body wants earthly stuff. And what did Jesus say? He said the soul wants to, but the flesh is weak. Jana baye. Mara Jana Baye Mara Lamara in a Pagra Zafunile. 
So Gana Boy Mariam Nahe, Gana Boy in the Anchmaya. So Jesus said the soul wants, but the flesh is weak. The soul wants to stay up, but the flesh is so weak, wants to sleep. So you see the opposite? The soul wants to stay up, but the flesh wants to sleep. Modil Madam Shekha. Marabudun Shaharta. Sabab Gana Boye Kat Aut Shaharta, Boye Kat Sapa. In a pogra zabun here. Come on, dear pogra zabun. Why is our bodies weak? You see? And that's the question. Because we always are looking at the world. We are always keeping our eyes on this world. We're taking our eyes off of Jesus Christ. What did what did Peter do? Iman Putrus Kamsha Kalu Aina Min Shika? Pilleg world. Yama ila world. Yama ila world. The sea is always the world. And where did Peter fall? Into the world. Why? Because he took his eyes off Jesus Christ and he looked at the world and he got scared. So, Iman is Why do we have fears? Why do we have anxiety? Because we look at the world. We take our eyes off of Jesus Christ. Come on, the Abil and Asha anxiety. Sabah Ishaqal, why name him Shikha and Hazet? El Dawa Alma. So, what happened here? There is a big fight. So, the Holy of Holies, which is in us, and that is the Holy Spirit that comes between the soul and the flesh. Why? Because there's a big fight. And now we're going to see what the Spirit does for us. That's when the Spirit comes between the soul and the flesh. So, the question is, why if we make friends from this world, we become enemies of God? Kamodi in odeh khorawuta dostuta min dawa alma ya wadish minit alaha. That's the question, Shamiran's question. Mani Jobni. Why if we make friends with this world, we become enemies of God? Anybody? So in So when when we are pleasing the people in the world, we are pleasing Satan. Satan because the prince of this world is Satan. Satan. But our prince is Jesus, Jesus Christ. He is our king. So in Achnan Mardir, but this is the ultimate question. What is the way you make friendship with this world? How? Yes. By compromising. Compromising in which way? With evil. With evil. So how do we do that? Like we go home today and we say, it's okay, I can still have 50 shirts and 50 pants. Very good. She is the only one that wears the same thing every day. I love you. You have everything to the point. Good job. You're right. You're absolutely right. I like that, Mutanna. That was beautiful. <laughs> So what Mutanna is saying for all of you guys to go and sell everything you have and give it to the poor. That was, that was great, yeah. That's what he's saying. That's beautiful. So, Modi la manayo, edanet odu khora wuta min dawa alma. How do we how do we make friendship with this world? We accept them the way they are. We can't accept them the way they are. We have to tell them the truth. So 
So if the world doesn't accept the truth, then that's their problem. If I'm gonna please man, and I'm gonna change the word of God, so I can please man, then I am walking away from the truth. So you can't do that. You cannot please man on the expense of Jesus Christ. You can't do that. You have to tell them the truth. Because Jesus said the truth shall set you free. Mere Shrana bit Avit Lohun Khira. Illa Illa Kun Khira mo eatun waya? So if 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 the truth will set you free, he's saying otherwise, then you are a slave to who? To the prince of this world. So in Ana Azan Mardi in Nashe, in Ana Azan Mardi in Nashe, Yudaya Dinye, Allah Sabbath Mshiha Ana Gripa. Then he cast on us a Sharika with that. I'm a Bakbalit on the Tirahu. Yeah. So Adia in Oretun Gubetwate, eaten Katosa in Ile Christmas, in Ile Easter, Easter, at the expense of Easter and Christmas. Now I'm going to bring my, uh, my, my gay friend home and I'll sit him at the table uh, with everybody and the family has to accept that. No, family don't have to accept that. The family has to tell them what is right. It's okay for them to sit at your table, but you have to give them the right lesson. You have to teach them what is right before you feed them. Feed their soul. Give them this. Give them what God is saying. Right? And in, in everything in their life. So, what happened? We started accepting things slowly. Slowly. And now look at our TVs. Look at our schools. Look at our life. Look at everything around you. Why? Because it's our fault. Because we accepted things. And what did the rich man do? He took advantage of that. And he changed it according to the prince of this world. <laughs> Right? So the prince of this world, are we here to fight him or to please him? That's the bottom line. Are you fighting him or are you pleasing him? Because he's going to fight you through the people from this world. How many friends you have are people from this world? And you say to them, it's okay this, it's okay this, it's okay this, it's okay this. How many people you please? You are pleasing the prince of this world. You are not pleasing your friend, you're not pleasing your brother, you're not pleasing other, you're pleasing the prince of this world. Can be in the same household that there is people from the prince of this world and people that are from the king of kings, yes, in the same household. How do they be to the majlis? Nashatina bakhaya kamara, unashatina marduya kasarma. How do they be to? Mumkin hawi dora bakhta. It can be a husband and a wife. It can be a brother and sister. They can be two brothers. They can be sisters. They can be a mother and a daughter, right? Yeah. I have a question. What if you're in a certain setting where you have no control over the music and it's absolutely just, I mean, it's music I heard and listened to before my pre-Christian years, as I like to call it, and it's absolutely disgusting. And it's like you have no control over changing it. How many times I tell you, don't go unless it's Janan Savasi? <laughs> no, no, I understand. I understand your question, Brati. She is, she is right. Sometimes you are in a position, in a place where you have no control over it, okay? And it's something you're going to hear that you don't want to hear. But is it possible for you to take off and leave? Not necessarily. You know what Jesus said? He said, Father, I am not praying for you to take these apostles out of this world, but to protect them in this world. But are you accepting it in sight? No. Exactly. And that's what God looks at. 
Are you accepting it inside or is it something a must? See? So, I'd be able to do it from the lip, and I'd be able to do it from the lip, and I'd be able to do it from the lip, and I'd be able to do it from So, that's the difference. See? So, I'm going to be able to do it. I'm going to be able to do it. It's so funny because I'm like, Christy, the whole time, like, stop it. He gets it. Like, stop saying it, you know? And people were looking at it. Who's that crazy girl so talking funny. to herself? Like, the transformation of how we used to listen to the music, that same music, and now it's like satanic, literally. Yeah, exactly. And that's why you got to watch out because those are the things that we can't take. We can't accept. But I don't know how you ended up in there. That's, you know, I mean, sometimes you end up there, but I don't know how you ended up there, you know? wonder what happened. Who invited you? Right? Some, How did you end up there? Great Christian, great Christian years. What am I telling you? Oh, oh okay. Oh, so it was your choice. You went. Well, I mean, yeah, I guess I, I, mean, I don't know. It's so all you could have just walked off anytime you want. No, no, no. No, no, no. You're talking about how I listen, used to listen to them? Oh, you used to listen to them. But now I am in a place where it's not my choice. I see. You see what I'm saying? Oh, like I'm saying, it's crazy how I used to listen to this music, and then after I was saved, I see how disgusting it is. I you know, see. even though it's like, oh, cute and what, it's not cute, and it's not okay. You know? Doesn't make sense yet. Exactly. But I'm saying. Love you guys. Go. Bye, God bless you. Yeah, do shalom. Mona, work on that thing for me. We get do after Easter. We're gonna feed the shelter. Got one. Yes. Yes, Saturday. Yes. Okay, man. God bless you. Yeah, I, I, I agree with you. And those so things will happen. Not my choice. Yeah. But, but again, again, it will happen sometimes. You know, some you know, your girlfriend's going to invite you to that shower or something. And you're going to have scenes that you don't like and see like that. But that doesn't mean you got to walk out. Because as long as you use your faith. Yeah. As long as it, whatever you I eat, whatever you drink, whatever you do, you do it for the glory of God. And that's what you got to remember. And sometimes, trust me, Jesus sat in places no man would have liked to sit there. No faithful man would have. But he had to. Why? Because he wanted to bring the message. And that's how you bring the message sometimes. So, so as long as you're not making friendship with them, you're not accepting it by heart, through the heart. That's why. Right? Okay. So, so let me to know the Haraya Marele, anything a Shuharane, Allah Hamodi Avit, Ichale Darkulu. In a anything a humble Allah Ibarahlu. Yet, Yavilu Shapakat. To Anna to the Shapakat, El Manit Anaboy in Odin Shapakat, El Mani by out Shapakat, El Humble. So God will have mercy on whom he wants to have mercy. Who does he have mercy on? On the humble ones. You see? So why is it God is saying, I'm going to have mercy on whom I want to have mercy? It's because he knows who he wants to have mercy on. Because he knows his people. Right? Okay, when do we need the Spirit to intercede for us? Now there is a fight in us, right? And that is when the, the Holy Spirit comes in between the body and the soul. What does, that, what does it do? Read it for Romans 8, 26 through 27. Kharakhwa. Romae Tmania. Vela Bukhrayo Kana Nayoga. 26 and 27, Baba. In the same way, the Spirit helps us in our weakness. We do not know what we ought to pray for. The Spirit himself intercedes for us through wordless groans. And he who searches our hearts knows the mind of the Spirit, because the Spirit intercedes for God's people in accordance with the will of God. 
ما راهتخا ابروخا كي هير الزبنوتا لا يطخ داخم صالخ انا روخا